everyone, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome. My name is Fabe, thank you so much for being here. If you are a returning subscriber, you can probably tell I am not in my normal setup. I am actually in Baby Drew's nursery, and I'm sorry if there's a little bit of an echo right now. All we have is the crib, and this lamp, and mirror, and everything else in front of me is empty, so there's probably some, like, sound issues. I don't know, hopefully not, but there might be. So I apologize if there is, but I wanted to film this video in here because this is a baby haul. It's specifically a gender neutral baby product and clothing haul. Just kind of a collective haul of things I have gotten over the last month or two that I wanted to share with you guys. And again, it's specifically gender neutral because my husband and I decided that we did not want to find out the sex of our baby until that baby comes out. So everything is gender neutral, can work for boy or girl. I did make a video explaining our thought process on that, why we are waiting to find out. I'll link that down below in my pregnancy playlist. You can kind of check out other pregnancy videos I've done. If you are new to my channel and found me for this pregnancy video, then that's great. Hello, hi. I do pregnancy videos probably mm, once a week or mm, once every two weeks, but most of my channel is makeup and beauty and things like that. So if you like that as well, make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and tap that notification bell. But otherwise, let's get right on into this gender neutral baby haul. Okay, so I think I'm gonna save the clothes for last and just start with some products because I have more clothes than products. So let's start with the products, get those out of the way and then move on to the cute little baby clothes. So the first thing I wanted to show you guys and I think I posted with this little guy on Instagram, but it's this little stuffed yellow lab puppy. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with this. I hope that this is Baby Drew's favorite little stuffed animal. We found this actually in store at Cabela's. I will try to find a link for it down below. It's just so cute. We have a yellow lab named Kip, if you didn't know that, and we just love yellow labs, and I just think that this is the cutest little yellow lab puppy. It's so soft, and it goes with the theme too, because my nursery theme is just kind of like creams and whites, so... I love this little guy. Next up, I am also obsessed with bunnies. I have this gray bunny here. This actually Nick's mom got for us. It's Hallmark brand, so I will definitely be able to find this and link it for you as well. How cute is this little bunny? I'm obsessed with bunnies. I'm getting bunny sheets, like bunny printed sheets for the crib. And what else bunny? I have something else bunny related that I'll show you in a bit, but I just love little bunnies. I don't know why. Speaking of the crib bedding, if you guys want to see a nursery tour once I am like all done putting everything together, give this video a thumbs up or comment down below that you want to see that because I definitely will do that. So yeah, this is the other little stuffed animal I wanted to show you guys. This baby is probably going to have so many stuffed animals. I was a huge stuffed animal little girl. I had so many stuffed animals and I love stuffed animals. Those and snow globes. Those are like my two favorite childhood things. You know what? While we're on bunnies, let me just show you this. It kind of more so goes with clothing, but it's not really clothing. This is from Pottery Barn. This is one of their bath wraps. I love the Pottery Barn bath wraps and this is one of the more like luxurious ones. It's the Monique Lulier and Pottery Barn Kids Bunny Baby Bath Wrap. This was actually a shower gift that was sent right to my house from someone who's not going to be able to make it to my shower, but I wanted to include it in this haul because it's just the cutest thing I've ever seen. The picture on the Pottery Barn website, I'm going to pop it up here so you can see it. Oh my gosh, it's the cutest little baby in this bath wrap. I had to have it, so I'm so glad it's here. My shower is not for another like three, four weeks, but I already have this little guy, so I wanted to show this to you. But moving on to other baby products, one thing I already do have that is like a bigger baby product is a Doc a Tot. Can you see that here? Yeah, sorry, it's kind of big. This is the name brand. I'm sure you guys have heard of this. This is very, very popular on Instagram and Basically what this is, I think mostly what it's used for is if you want your baby to sleep like in your bed with you, you put them in this. That's not how I plan to use it because I'm not going to have our baby sleep in our bed. That's just my personal preference. The baby's going to sleep in like a bassinet for a little bit or just go right into the crib. We'll kind of just have to see 
play it by ear but what I think this will be great for is if we're just on the couch and I want to lay the baby down or if we're like playing on the floor I think this will be perfect you also can get a toy arch to go with it so I got this arch this black and white arch and I didn't get these little hangy ones I got different ones I got these guys I think these ones are a little bit cuter these are like little woodland animals there's a owl a deer and a elephant. I do want to shout out Docatop for sponsoring this video. Thank you so much. I think their brand is awesome. I'm so happy to work with them. I think they have great products and it's going to be perfect for baby Drew. So thank you Docatop. A little bit more about this. I got it in just the plain white and I did get a spare cover. So just a spare white cover. They have a ton of cute prints but I just kind of wanted white. I'm more of a neutral person so I just got a spare white cover and then this one already has a white cover on it so basically I have two to go back and forth between but it's just a really firm nice pillow like very firm and it has these big sides so the baby can't roll out of it I think it'll just be perfect for on the couch or on the floor playing around with the little mobile above I think it's so fun, so adorable, it'll be perfect for little Instagram pictures. And this specifically is the Deluxe Plus one. It's the zero to eight month. I think they have a bigger one for bigger kids. And everything I talk about today will be linked down below if you guys want to check that out. The next little baby product I have is this from Binksy Baby. This is like a little thing for your grocery cart that you can just put your older baby in or you can put your car seat in so that the car seat doesn't have to go like just straight down in the grocery cart. It kind of is like a sling that holds it. So I got this print here. It's gray and like teal. It's called the shopping cart hammock. So you can use it from birth until the child can sit up. Here's another picture so you can kind of see how it works. I don't know, it just looked interesting to me and I saw a bunch of people on Instagram with them, so we'll give it a try. Okay, so now moving on to little baby clothes. First, I'm going to show you a pair of shoes I got, which I think are just so cute. Baby shoes are so cute. Look at these little guys. They're like little Converse, but they're not Converse. They're like an off-brand. These are from Little Wanderers. I will link their website down below. They always have a ton of deals. I actually got one in a bigger size as well because it was like buy one, get one free or something like that. So I figured why not have them for when the baby is really little and then once they grow out of them, I'll have a bigger size. Since they're white, I definitely could use these for boy or girl. Next up, I already showed you guys these in my Walmart haul, but just wanted to mention them again. I got these cute little sweatpants from Walmart. These are six to nine months, so they're a little bit bigger. And so are these gray ones, but so cute. I kind of picture if it's a boy, obviously you can just pair it with any shirt. But if it's a girl, I'll kind of amp it up with a pink bow or a pink shirt or something like that to make it a little bit more girly. I also got these little joggers with the stripes. How cute! These are a little bit smaller. These are zero to three months. And they're a little bit lighter as well, so this will be better for summer. I'm due in June, so these smaller ones will be better. And then these, for when they're older, are like fleece lined. So those will be perfect for like fall and winter. I also picked up a few newborn size little leggings. <laughs> these are so cute. It's little clouds. This is Carter's brand. I think I actually got these at Target, but you can get Carter's in a few different places, but I'll link them down below. So this little pack came with these ones with the clouds and then just a plain white pair. And they're just like little legging material. Really nice. They're so tiny. Oh my gosh. Again, that's newborn size, and then I also got them in this print. I haven't even opened them up yet, but a stripe pattern, gray and white, and then just a plain gray. I got a few other things from Target and Carter's. So I got these newborn onesies, and they match the leggings. These were on clearance, too, so I literally got this entire pack for $3, which is insane. So this is what the little onesie looks like. Oh, it's kind of skinny. It'll fatten it up a little bit. And if you wanted to see it with the matching pants, how cute. Or you could mix and match, which I love. So you could put it with the white pants. You could put it with the striped pants I showed or the gray ones. This is just a plain white one. This one's very cute. It's stars, little gray stars. And then this one is just like a striped polka dot 
print. I also got some three month onesies from Carter's. So I have this one right here. This is kind of boyish. I guess I could put a yellow bow if it's a girl, but it has like blue, orange, and yellow on it, but the rest in the pack I loved. This one is a gray stripe one. I just love stripes. And I'm obsessed with yellow. I know for gender neutral stuff, you can kind of go between green or yellow. I prefer yellow and especially since it's summertime when the baby's going to be born, I think yellow is just perfect. So this is a yellow and white straight little onesie. And then this one has giraffes on it. So it's yellow and gray giraffes. Okay, this next clothing item I'm so excited for. This is actually something that my parents got for little baby Drew. It is the cutest little onesie. It says, welcome to the world. And I think that they got this at Nordstrom or Lord and Taylor or one of those. I will definitely find it and link it below. This is for newborn and I kind of think this might be the little outfit that we put them in at taking them home from the hospital or at least bring this to the hospital. It also has a little hat that goes with it. It just has tiny little gray stars. They also got this little swaddle blanket that matches that also says welcome to the world. So cute. I also got some long sleeve onesies and these are from Gerber. They're their organic cotton newborn onesies. They have the mitten cuffs on them for like preventing scratching. So I thought these would just be good to have. I'm sure I'll get more of these at the shower, but when I was in the store, I just thought these looked nice and they're really, really soft. They're way softer than these Carter's ones. I think they were probably more expensive. But yeah, they're organic Gerber onesies. They feel super soft and nice. This I quickly showed you guys in my Marshalls video. Was it a Marshalls video or a TJ Maxx video where I actually went in store and looked through all of the makeup, but I made a little detour to the baby section. And I think I showed you guys this at the end in the car, but wanted to show it to you guys again. This is from Hudson Baby, and it is zero to three months, and there's five bodysuits in here. So there's this one with the teddy bear. Then there's this one. It has like um, tan aztec -y print on it. And then there's just this plain like gray one. And then there's a bigger stripe. So like gray and white stripe. And then there's this one, which is so cute. It says sweet as honey and it has a honey pot. I also have some six to nine month onesies that kind of go with the theme, more clouds. These I think you can get at Walmart. This was also a early gift. There's this one as well that has moon and stars. There's this kind of green one, so that could go for boy or girl. And then there's another gray and white stripe. Oh, I have one other little product that's not really clothing that I forgot to mention. I got these pacifiers. I think they were sent to me in some sort of like free baby box or something like that. These are the Nuck Orthodontic Pacifiers. This one's blue, so if it's a girl, I probably won't use this one. But this one has a little bunny on it, a gray bunny. BPA free, 100% baby approved orthodontic shape for zero to six months. So that is basically everything I have for baby Drew so far. I have a lot more to get and I still have my shower. So let me know if you'd want to see any sort of video about my shower registry or maybe like a baby shower haul. Let me know if that's something that you guys would want to see or be interested in. I do always try to show my bump in these pregnancy videos. So let me do that here. Sorry, we're comfy today. I'm just wearing leggings. But I am currently 25 weeks. So there's the little, the little baby. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, again, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And leave me a comment with some video ideas, either baby or makeup or anything you'd like. I actually did do a tutorial on this makeup look, so be on the lookout for that. It should be the next video up on my channel. I love you all so, so much, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!